They made me their scapegoat, so I got back at them by burning down their company. I ended up working behind the counter as a customer service manager, basically a step up from a cashier. It's fancy when seen on a CV but there's nothing really to it. I took bets, chatted with customers, helped people with machines and, for the vast majority of my shift, sat around waiting for something to do. I got on well with my co-workers, or so I thought, and had no major issues. It was 20 hours a week, about $1 more than minimum wage with a lot of overtime required of me in irregular shift patterns. Though I had no issue with the job, beyond how difficult it was to juggle the schedules of both of my jobs. In February of 2019, after working for the company for six months, I was invited to a probation hearing. It cannot be emphasized enough that it was a probation hearing in which I would have my performance reviewed and, as informed in training, was entitled to a pay rise at the end of it. I arrived that morning to a disciplinary hearing where, without even a shred of evidence, I was accused of 11 different categories.